And right now, two vaccines have FDA emergency use authorization for the prevention of COVID-19, one from Moderna, the other from Pfizer. So what exactly are the differences between the two? KCTV5 stands for you. Here's what two infectious disease experts had to say. Two coronavirus vaccines have shown to be highly effective, but there are differences between Moderna and Pfizer's vaccines. Moderna vaccine is authorized for age 18 and up, and the Pfizer vaccine is for age 16 and up. In terms of effectiveness, they're essentially the same, says Dr. Stephen Thomas of Upstate, who's the lead principal investigator in the Pfizer vaccine trial. But Moderna measures slightly less effective in ages 65 and up. So Pfizer, the efficacy analysis was performed seven days after the second vaccine was given. For Moderna, it was 14 days after the second vaccine was given. No matter which vaccine you get, you'll have to receive two of the same doses. For the Pfizer vaccine, the second dose is after three weeks. For the Moderna vaccine, the second dose is after one month. Dr. Thomas and Dr. Helen Jacoby at St. Joe's say with the Moderna, you may have more side effects, signs your immune system is kicking into gear to create immunity. But whether the symptoms are significant is still unknown. These vaccines also require different temperatures for storage. While St. Joe's can only store the Moderna, Upstate can store both. Pfizer's is stored at minus 70, uh, 70 degrees Celsius and Moderna can be stored at a warmer temperature at minus 20 degrees Celsius. Both doctors say it shouldn't matter which one you end up receiving. Both of them have very, very similar performance uh, profiles and um, you should not wait or decline one to receive the other. You should get vaccinated. There's no reason to think that one or the other is any better. So just take whatever you're offered.